This is Dr. Claudia Kotka from the Washington Institute for Dentistry and Laser Surgery. Today's topic deals with um, the scenarios of the type of oral lesions that you may have experienced uh, um, when uh, you either uh, have a history of habitual uh, biting, uh, either the cheeks or the lip, or perhaps it happens because of an accident or an incidental uh, finding. That particular um, uh, tissue that may, for instance, be uh, felt like a nodule or maybe uh, something like a sore or, or, or a, a um, aggregate of, of tissue or a bundle of tissue uh, that may be small but may persist for longer than two weeks. It really ought to be uh, taken care of in terms of not just diagnosis but also excision. And having the aspect of laser intervention in terms of surgical excision really allows for a early intervention in terms of removing any type of tissue which even though at that particular time may not necessarily present any type of abnormality in terms of cancers, but can certainly predispose to a change with time. And we never know the variables that come in, our, in, in the future. So just being an early intervention, proactive, ensure that when you do have and you feel that you do have something that's just abnormal that wasn't there before. Um, the aspect of laser surgical techniques that we have um, as clinicians been able to enjoy uh, to render, um, of course, uh, healing and treatment in ways that are optimal and of course effective and efficient really gives us an opportunity to have those uh, be available and make them available to patients. For more information, please don't hesitate to contact us at www.dclaserdentist.com.